We were under pressure, so we have no choice than to upload the results in favor of Tunubu. INEC officials tell the court. And I don't hear. The truth is that the APC um, agitators, the APC officials were on the neck of the of the INEC officers in different pool. Look at what was shown on the TV screen of that very day. Didn't you see how the APC members were holding canes, stick, to push people to vote for Tunubu or else they will be beaten? Anybody that goes to a particular polling unit to vote, once you refuse to vote for Tunubu, you, once you say you want to vote for Labour Party or PDP, they will chase you back. Unless you say you want to vote for Tunubu. So you tell me, how won't APC win that presidential election? And the worst part is that our Nigerian government was seeing this very thing on that very day and nobody intervened to stop the madness. What was this military, what were the securities doing to chase those out those stocks away from the polling unit, blue polling unit from doing that crazy thing and they claim that they, they were out there to monitor the election we have no military they all conspired with apc yes they conspired that's what i was saying To read on Tyrapa. Let's check the content. This is evening news. The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has not yet fully uploaded the complete results of all voting units to its results reporting portal, IREV, even two weeks after the presidential election, according to an article in Punch News. Out of a total of 176,846 survey units, only 166,168 results have been uploaded so far, which represents 93,996% of the overall results. Consequently, there are still 10,678 survey units whose results have not been published on the commission portal. Nigerians, we are anticipating that the election results will be uploaded on election day as promised by the INEC chairman, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu. However, the failure to fulfill this promise resulted in criticism directed towards INEC for not making the results available on its viewing portal. The frustration over the delay upload led by led to a strike by some party agents at the National Coalition Center in Abuja. It is worth noting that despite the opposition party's excitement, INEC declared Bola Tunubu the candidate of the ruling of Progressive Congress Congressional Party as the president elect with a lead of newly nearly 8.8 .8 million votes. The main opposition candidates, Atiku Abaka and Peter Obi, received 6.9 million and 6.3 million votes, respectively. See, let me tell you, my dear listeners, the architect of all these problems is from the INEC. And that is why there is no, that, that's why there is nothing you will say concerning this very election that you, you won't mention the name of INEC. The INEC name must be mentioned. Then they must be mentioned because they are the architect of the whole problem. They are the cause. They are the masterminders. You understand? And that is just it. So I am not surprised that this is actually coming up like this. Imagine, till this very moment, the election result has not been uploaded. Is that no madness? Is that no craziness? Is there no wickedness? Is there no greed? Is there no self-centeredness? That is to tell you that these people have plan. They have plans. They have not achieved their plan. 
Hmm. Nigeria, the way we do. All right. Um, let's quickly uh, hear from you and let's know what your your opinion on what already have just been taken note of. Maybe don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.